Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Sabrina and today I'm going to create this colourful blue look for you today. I'm going to get straight into it because I really want to show you how I created this look. Um, it was actually quite easy. Um, the two palettes I used was the Morphe 15N and my favourite, favourite palette, Urban Decay Electric Palette. This palette is so beautiful. If you just love colour, you're going to love this palette. Just look at the colours. They're so pretty. This is actually my second one. Um, I've used the first one and it's in the bin because it's empty so okay so I'm just gonna go in with the colour selfie which is um a warm brownie colour and I'm just gonna put that here. Remember guys you can always add colour so it's just best to um start off with a little bit and build it up as you're going along. I really love this colour to be honest with you I wasn't really a fan of warm tones first I was just like black blues and just a bit weird with my colour range but not warm tones like I didn't like oranges I didn't like orangey brands copper colours I wasn't really a fan of red but um now it's actually this palette that's converted me I think Try and drag it a bit over, not too much, just basically what's left on the brush and always add more if you need it. This was actually a really fun look to do because it was so easy and I'm so glad it was easy not complicated because I literally did one eye and this tripod was just not working for me today. Okay, now for the fun bit. Um, what brush did I use? Okay, I'm just picking up this crease brush and I'm going to the electric palette and I'm picking up that dark blue. It's actually called Chaos and that describes me perfect. Anyway, I'm gonna pick that up and I'm gonna use it first to blend at the top because I don't want it to be harsh and I don't really wanna waste any product. So I tend to just blend it out first. I mean, like, I know it's full, but you can always add a bit of colour. No harm in that. To be honest with you, I think all Urban Decay palettes deliver no matter what. So I'm going to take my finger and just put it on with my finger. And this is where I'm going to intensify the colour now. I just love blue eyeshadow to be honest with you. I actually do have blue glitter and I can't wait to try it. It's from the collection brand and it just looks so pretty. I'm just going to take a bit more on that brush, yeah, we'll put that brush right in front of my face, just to pick a bit of it up and just blend it to the top, just like that. Now I'm going to go back in with that other brush and just quickly pick up a bit more of the selfie colour, I feel like that's the only really colour that I've used from that palette. I think it's gonna be too pointy there, so I'm not gonna mm. This is actually a look that I'm doing for work guys, so it's not major. And my feet in there just fell on the floor. And so jumpy. Look just right. Let me see if I'm moving without this camera right now, please. And that's the look. Now, I don't know if you can tell on this eye, but I am wearing blue mascara. It's from the collection, it, but it's not the way I thought it was going to be. But, um, yeah, you can't really tell. Like, I have this other mascara, it's from the L'Oreal. I think it's Miss Manga or Miss Magna. 
that is so good it's a turquoise one and it's the best colour mascara I've ever had I've had no trouble with it whatsoever and the, the pigment on the mascara like I have jet black eye lashes um, and literally two coats of it just cover but this one you can't even tell it's blue medium features you can but it's really weird because normally I have collection products and they're really good Maybe it's because my eyelashes are really black. Maybe. Mm -hmm. I get asked by people a lot to use my own lashes sometimes when I put on extreme mascara. And it's actually complimenting. I think I'm really blessed to have long lashes and thick brows to be honest. So I've got a friend and she literally has no lashes. Like literally. So that is it. I'm not going to put on um, mascara on my bottom lashes. Or should I? Mm, why not? This mirror is so good by the way, it's my friend got it for me from um, China and it's the best. I have two average hair poison but I just don't know that color. I think I'm going to intensify this color slightly more by just colouring in my waterline. If I can find oh, here it is. Oh I love this. This is such a good eyeliner honestly. Like this was sent to me as part of the infallible bag. I love it in Pablo, but it's one of the best ones. By the way, I had already been just talking to you for the products. Um, for my brows, I use Maybelline um, pen. I think it's in my hand so I can show you when it was. I have so many things here, just, I just can never find them whenever I need them. Um, here it is. No, it's not. No, it's not. No, it's not. Okay, but it's the Artist Brow Pencil. Um, it's so good. I am totally in love with it. Um, I set my eyes with this concealer. This concealer is my favorite, favorite, favorite concealer. This is where is it? Can you tell? Nude. It's such a good concealer. I have the neutralizer as well, but I use that for under eye because I do have a lot of dark circles. Um, I set it all with the translucent translucent powder um, and sometimes I put on collection powder as well um, so literally um, my highlight is amazing as well I'm so in love with this highlighter it's just so amazing but anyway this is the finished look guys I really hope you enjoyed it and I hope it was really helpful
I really hope you enjoyed it please give it a thumbs up and comment any suggestions for next videos or any comments you have in general um, and please 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 subscribe to my channel and also hit notifications so you get a notification when I upload a new video which will be on a regular basis I promise